Jason, thank you. From the Big Ten to the Pac-12 in a rematch here for number six Arizona against Washington State. We're in the Palouse, Pullman, Washington. Washington State went to Tucson and beat Arizona, gave Tommy Lloyd his only home loss of his two-year tenure. And a block by Ballo. Arizona up tempo. Rich Waltz along with Matt Mulebach. This should be a fun game. Ballo, look at the high low. Great passing. And as Julius Tubelis. Arizona wants to push tempo. Kirk Creesa, terrific point guard for the Wildcats. And a three. And that's good. And that's a great sign for the Wildcats. So we're off to us. He can go one on one with Ballo. Boy, he torched him. Just like that. Down the lane. And with a two hand rebound, Andre Yakamovsky. Baseline drive. Gay again. And he's fouled. Oh, Justin Powell jumped from last year to this year. Yeah, one of the most improved, maybe the most improved in the Pac-12, along with Umar Rodman, cut off. Rodman, a good three-point shooter, especially from the corner. Gay on Corks. And rebound and go. Here comes Arizona. Ramey in transition. Trailing is Henderson for a three. Got it. Yeah, long rebound. Arizona in and rebound. That allows us to get out on the break. Henderson nails one. Powell driving. Missed the layup. Creesa. Tubelis, catch and a foul. And it's Muhammad Gay. He is a really tough mismatch for Arizona. Both sides, I guess, who can exploit that mismatch is the key. All right, a couple minutes. Absolutely. Kyle Smith says he does everything well. Crease another three. He's hit one from both wings. You can see the confidence Stockton talked to this team last night. Crease had a number of questions for Stockton. You could really kind of feel the veteran talking to this uh, sophomore junior guard and really came out hot tonight. Jade Mullins is in for Washington State. Around the screen. That's Kimani Winsu. And that's Washington. Oh. An audience with John Stockton. Arizona State in Spokane practiced at Gonzaga today. That's partially blocked and then sent back in to Bellis. Caught it out of the air and finishes for the bucket. Well, because to the glass so they can get back in transition. And transition defense is at the top of Kyle Smith's chalkboard tonight for sure. A nifty move to Bellis. And that's a classic, the quick jab to the right. That got Muhammad Gay off guard. That enabled Tabellis to get back to his left. It's a 10 2 run right now by Arizona. Remember, they got up to a quick start. Washington State answered. Gay, that's blocked. No whistle. And a foul there. Did it hit the backboard first? Yes. I think it did. I think it was a. Wildcats, of course, on this Northwest. Well, normally we say, ball don't lie if somebody. I did. <laughs> No, you didn't lie. No, just, no, was, no. Correction there. Now, this time he actually does go right. Oh, he is something. Wow, and finishes with his right. I've with a, a backdoor every once in a while because they want to put pressure on Gay and on the on the wings. And that's different from the first meeting. It is, yeah. They really laid off Gay, and that's why Gay had such a big night. Boswell stepped back. Line drive three. And I love his keys, by the way. And how cool is the saying? Shoot the cover off the ball. I mean, that's that's awesome. Rodman in a crowd draws contact. And Washington State trying to work their way back by getting to the line there. That's really what kept him in that. You you mentioned it, 12 threes in that game. I string quad trying to keep warm. He's looked for Washington State. Boswell challenging him. Missed the three. And the rebound. Ripped down by Justin Powell. And Powell's the guy that has had to to really take over the point guard role. He's more of a combo guard. Yakovsky. Yakovsky, percent from distance in Washington State is within seven. Now, Yaki had that turf toe, but he's an incredible player all around. He can shoot it. He's kind of a point forward. You see the shooting skills there. Boswell, entry to Bellis, left-handed hook. Not many big men have a shooter. 74-61 in Tucson. Washington State bombed 
12 threes in that game. Rodman starting down the lane, and he's bumped, and he's getting free throws. We're yeah, talking about him. Just watch me as such a feel for the maybe a, a really good sophomore year, maybe not the best junior. He sticks it out, sticks it out. Cedric Henderson back in as well. Larson. Okay, got the mismatch here with two Bellas if they find him. Creesa wow. again, he's hit three of them. That time with a man in his three of three, all from beyond the arc. You know, he shoots it with such fluidity, too, and confidence. I haven't seen him shoot it with that much confidence all year. Yaki hits, gets to the baseline. But at Colorado, 12.7 rebounds. Remember, Colorado hit a three late to win that game. Larson, a little bit of contact, hung in the air. Darling, the lefty. Gay had the rebound. Ballo picks it up. And Arizona throws it away. Justin Powell in the break. Floater. <laughs> Haven't seen a lot of floaters. And Kirk Creesa is three of three. He's got a much tighter cover on him right now with Powell. Larson. Got through and finishes. Strong move. Pella Larson. Gay came out with two Bellas on that one. I thought he would stay in and help, but Larson seeing the wide open just like Powell is here. Finish. Oh, what a finish. And he makes it. Justin Powell. Super impressive, very intense. And, you know, it's interesting. Kirk Risa. You know, he, he's talked a lot about different things, and Carissa was the one that asked the most questions of any player on the team. And none about his shorts, right? <laughs> that was uh, stretches the lead back to nine. Biggest lead in this game in his first half has been 12. And Washington State trying to find the answer offensively. Mullins, not a great lob, gave the catch, and it's blocked by Henderson from behind. Gay gets it back. Henderson misses the three. Darling has the loose ball. Yaki, a great job down there boxing out. Howell in transition. Floater, bucket, and a foul. That's natural position. Yeah, that's pretty impressive. I mean, you could step into that role, stepping between the two. They're not sure what that was about. Good job by Pella. And it's a live ball turnover. Henderson on his way up the floor. Steps through. Henderson 79% from the line, and he knocks home the first. Larson's energy from the bench, and Henderson has started the UCLA and the USC wins, forced that one. I think he was looking for a foul, questioned the one that last time down. Darling really getting into Larson. That could have been a whistle. Fallow, Larson's in tight. He's getting more penetration this year in the first half. Much better rhythm on that one, but still doesn't cut. You know, Carissa, who made his first three threes, misses that in a rebounding foul on Arizona. Was Clay playing at that time? I should know that. I'm sure they heard about it after the loss in Tucson. Couple free throws, and it's back to a six-point game. And Clay, the greatest Washington State player of all time. Ballo against Gay, steps through, big, he walked. I was about to say that was a big hop. And a little gotten after it. Powell, Jabe Mullins is in, good three-point shooter. I think they'll go right here, Rich Gay at the top. They'll get guys coming off screens. They'll try to look for someone on the three. If not, they'll probably get Gay on a one-on-one -on -one with Ballo. Powell against Henderson. Here comes Mullins with the screen. Mullins, that's a deep three. Missed it. Long rebound. Taken back. Powell gets it up and scores. And a steal. 
in a shot that won't count had it gone, but what a finish for Washington State. Arizona has to start this second half with Dylan Darling in the game. TJ Bamba is on the bench with three fouls. Rodman turned down a three, penetrates, kicks. Nice catch by Powell. This is Gay, 24, the first time they met. Falling away, and that bangs home. And Gay. Washington State four and six in conference. There, that's the high low where you get Yaki. Incredible job. A team that I think a lot of people thought was top 20. Larson, nice catch and finish by Courtney Ramey. That's the type of transition points that Arizona is used to. And again, let's see what Washington State, how can they get shots with Gay out of the game? He's really the facilitator for everyone. How about a back cut yeah. and a sweet left hand? get off a screen and that ball deflected never really got the shot off Larson going hard in the lane and scores that's a difficult shot and he made it under Yakimovsky great job there by Larson and a good kick ahead by Boswell Mullen driving through will somebody hit a three finally that's Justin Powell put it on the on the deck and get to the rim Nice back cut, good rotation. Nice. Henderson three from the corner, missed it. This is had everything they wanted there, just not knocking it in. Gay in transition. Washington State has been all night. They've never led in this game. Larson again. Wow, from the wing, going points. Five of seven. How quick is the first step by Larson from the wing position? Whoa. Darling fouls. Pretty good job there by Boswell. Thought he got What's your Pac-12 researchers on? I know. I mean, I get those emails like as a six man. I think six man requirements are a rep. Looking for an entry to Tubelis. He's got Gay on his back. Creasa looks at the clock. Shot clock down to five. Long. Tubelis catch and score. How up was the Tubelis screen? He popped Darling right there, got him off balance. Gay had to help out. That got him open down in the baseline. That's a really high low. That's right. Creasa up the floor. Oh, look at the transition bucket. And the Arizona stretches the lead to six. And how fast and beautiful. Almost like a soccer fast break right there. Boom, 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 layup. Darling. Feeds the post. Gay facing, falling away. And that's beautiful. Easy, right? That yes. Yeah. Great stat for him. He steps it up. Crease is doubled, looking for the roll. Finds Tubelis again. That's a creative point guard. I mean, none of those entries are easy, right? Oh, that was a foul there. Boswell. Yes! Kylan Boswell, the freshman out of Still yep. own him. They do. Yeah, very successful. Okay. Bamba still trying to get his first points of the night. Two of the best scorers in this game haven't scored much at all. Bamba has not scored. In the Northwest, if you don't like the weather, just wait 15 minutes, and that's what is in the top 74 in the net. Washington State is actually... 540 to go seven down. Do they have a run in them right now? I think they do Washington State missing another free throw. They've been pretty good there tonight 13 to 15 Creesa Got the three His fourth he had a drought he hit his shooting have confidence out there Bamba for T.J. Bamba, maybe that's a shame with a small lineup. They've done that a lot the last three games. Ramey misses the three, and the rebound to Justin Powell. Bamba with the ball in his hands, averages 15 a night. Those were his first three. Gets a screen, gets the lane, gets a bucket. Amazing. You see the ball go in, and you see it go in from a three. That gives you Ballo to Bellis, Henderson, Larson, Creasa. He should just go one-on-one -on -one here. Oh, it's a soft touch. 
Man, he's so skilled. He had 27 and 14 in the loss to Washington State. Bamba trying to cook right now. Fouled. And the shot blocks. Brought him to his staff. He just arrived a couple weeks ago. Go up. Tabellus has that same move. Really cool to see the Arizona coaches and the Gonzaga coaches today at practice talking. Mark Few, Tommy Lloyd, they had a dinner last night together. Bamba falls over. Creesa buries a three. Bamba's hurt. Looked like he obviously got hit. Mike Pereira on this one. <laughs> One and one didn't because the table didn't give the officials the notice. By the way, it was a, clight, a, a tight game at the end. They lost, so that was a, a painful lesson there. Seven-point game. Well, Bamba, the, I mean, that's not easy to hit two free throws when no one's at the line and you're by yourself. So big for him to step up there. They need him to step up again. He gets inside, man in the air, falls out of bounds, and it stays with Washington State. But we're under two minutes. Five Gotta seconds. get it in, and they get the timeout. Arizona does. They'll have one left. They really did not handle it against UCLA on Saturday. Got UCLA back into that game in really just the last minute. Krista clears a three. Uh-uh, it's short. Rebound, knocked out, and saved. By Powell, Washington State needs a bucket. They're down seven. Minute and a half left. Bamba in the lane. Bamba weaving. Lost the ball. And Arizona's got it. How about that? Creesa, good hustle. Finds Boswell. That's a huge turnover. Yeah, Bamba just trying to do everything. you got to give him credit. He's trying everything he can. Tough break for him on that one. Arizona's number six in the country for a reason. Corner, Ramey, three! And that could do it. You know, the bomb to turn over, Ramey, three. I agree with you. There's, that may be it unless Washington State comes up with a miracle. Howell with the drive and the miss. And Arizona has a 10-point lead and the ball. And probably some revenge for the loss on their home court. Well, I think you said it, Rich. That was the first home loss ever for Tommy Lloyd in two years. So that, that's one you don't want to take if you're him in this team. A little sloppy at the end of the clock. Nekomovsky has it, just 20 seconds to play. And he'll drive in and score on the layup. Kyle Smith's going to call a timeout. Final seconds in Pullman. Arizona, Friso run it down, and a miss on a dunk. Rodman's three at the buzzer is good, and that'll cut the final margin down. Hold on. Larson will have it, and Arizona gets the win. Tommy Lloyd. And the Wildcats, number six in the country, 18 and three now, seven and three in the Pac-12.